Welcome to Extension Jeopardy. I'm your host, Austin Brown. Today we have three contestants, Alvin, Mike, and Brian. The rules are simple. The contestants will have to pick a category and amount, and then a video clue will appear, and they will be given 10 seconds to answer in the form of a question. Let's begin. I'll take introduction for 100. I'm the County Extension Director and Agriculture Agent, and I work to support the profitability and sustainability of Camden County Farms. Who is Austin Brown? I'll take introductions for 300. She is the 4-H Program Assistant and JCPC Coordinator. She provides diversion programs for adjudicated youth, such as teen court and community service. She assists in leading prevention programs for at-risk youth, such as interpersonal skill building classes and summer camps. Who is Marsha Barron? I'll take introduction for 400. Hi, I am the new 4-H agent for Camden County Extension. In my role, I will be developing programs based on the motto of hand, heart, heads, and health. Who is Angie Brickhouse? I'll take introductions for 200. I'm the Family and Consumer Science Area Agent for Currituck and Camden Counties. I enjoy providing nutrition, education, and helping people develop healthy habits. I also provide um, food safety and food preservation classes. Who is Olivia Patchell? I'll take introduction for 600. This organization connects North Carolinians with research-based information and technologies from our land-grant universities, NC State and nc a &T State University. What is North Carolina Cooperative Extension? I'll take introduction for 500. She is the County Extension Administrative Assistant and is responsible for day-to-day -day operations here at the Extension Office. Who is Amy Twitty? I'll take program impacts for 300. In 2021, the Interpersonal Skill Building Focus Program served 24 students. Camp Blue served 13 students, and five students were diverted to teen court and or community service. The biggest success for this program is reestablishing teen court to provide support to our juvenile justice system. What is the JCPC program and youth services? I'll take program impact for 200. In 2021, clients learned to prepare and preserve local foods safely. They also learned to develop healthy habits, which included increasing physical activity, uh, improving their diets, eating mindfully and being mindful, as well as being grateful. This year, programming impact and reach was enhanced by virtual classes, which allowed clients to participate at their leisure. What is Camden County Family and Consumer Science? I'll take program impacts for 100. In 2021, this program hosted crop production meetings, taught pesticide safety education classes, conducted on-farm research, and assisted farmers with on-farm problem solving. This led to Camden farmers and agribusiness people realizing over $1.7 million in income gains and preserved wages by utilizing information provided through cooperative extension programs. What is Camden County Agricultural Programs? I'll take program impacts for 500. In 2021, we provided opportunities for kids to attend camp, experience school enrichment, and participate in STEM activities. What is the Camden County 4-H program? I'll take program impact for 600. Altogether, in 2021, Camden Extension staff delivered 69 educational programs, totaling 243 hours of instruction, which led to them contacting the public with 4,112 direct contacts and 78,653 indirect and digital media contacts. Camden Extension staff sought grants, recruited volunteers, and received in-kind donations totaling $99,290 to support programmatic efforts. What is the job well done? Thank you to all of our contestants, but we would like to congratulate Mr. Alvin Shaw as today's big winner. Yeah! And thank you for tuning in. To learn more about all that we have going on here at the Extension Office, please visit our website 
or give us a call today. Until next time.